Right, Model Rocks 321 here on the way to the launch field early morning here in Arizona. Not many cars on the freeway, it's a few. So I have a special rocket I'm gonna be flying today. You will see the SD's executioner I'm gonna be flying in my Project X SR71 Blackbird. I've been struggling with that thing. I gotta get that in the air, I gotta get that to perform correctly. Hopefully the day or today is the day that that happens. But I have a special rocket. Stay tuned. I am at the launch site, getting set up, setting everything up. Went through a couple flights here. Um, got the Project X SR71 Blackbird, as you know. Still trying to get that to be a successful flight. And here I have the uh, SD's Executioner. And I have a very special rocket I'm going to be showing you in just a little bit. We'll get that in the air too. All right, Model Rocket 321. Here we go, going in five, four, three, two, one. There we go. Damn. Parachute, 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 three, third. Oh, it ripped off. Damn, ripped damn. off, hit the ground, done. Damn. Keep an eye on that orange one for me. Yeah, I got it. All right. So the SR-71 Blackbird is going too fast. It was a nice launch parachute still ripped off the nylon so there you have it it's just going too fast for those two engines that appear and that not even a nylon that was an upgrade from the plastic ones I used to use when I first started doing this project it crashed out here somewhere I saw it nosedive it's probably done so that may be the end of this project SR 71 Blackbird not sure where it's at. I gotta find it. It's actually lost in this deep. There's some fire ants. It's always ants out here. Okay, so it's lost right now. I gotta find it. All right, so I just spent about 10 minutes searching for the SR71 Project X, and here it is. It is probably destroyed now. I may have to scrap this project. I've been attempting this project for many years now yeah it looks like it's done i think i'm gonna have to call it a day it is nose dived into the ground you can see it right there project x maybe no more both engines live it was a great flight but i saw when it ripped off the parachute again and that was an upgrade from the plastic as i stated my friend marlo is way out there he's looking for the tail cone in the plastic chute he's over there i don't know if you can see he's way out there I'm gonna head over there and talk to him, but I'm gonna pull this out of the ground. And this is disaster. This is disaster. So I'm gonna go in and get this before I do that. Let me. But yeah, um, here we go. Time to pull them out the ground. It's been the soil been soft out here in Arizona since we had a lot of rain and stuff recently. I'm gonna pull it out, see what we got. Yeah, this is the same damage the other one did, and I had repaired it. This was it. So it crunched all the way in. The cone usually stays pretty good. It goes right in there, really streamlined, but that is destroyed. That is destroyed. So I'm going to um, make my way out to my boy. He's looking for the parachute because it ripped off. Everything worked. It re rejected, but it's just going too fast for what I'm trying to do. So I'm going to have to uh, go back to the drawing board on this. And this may be the end of the Project X SR71 Blackbird. What a tragedy. What a tragedy. So, be right back. All right, so as you saw, SR-71 was stuck in the ground, and here's the parachute, which was also lost. My boy Marlo was searching for that for me. So here's the Kevlar. This ripped off. It's just going too fast. Hopefully you guys are getting... Yeah, there we go. There's the piston. Everything performed, but it's just going too fast, and it rips off. And it rips off the parachute. I had C-67s. This is still going way too fast. So there we have it. Model Rocks 321 here about to launch the Estes Executioner on an F44. Here we go. Going in five, four, three, two, one. Woo wee. <laughs> yeah, that was parachute. And he's coming down right above us. That was a launch. Hopefully I can get in here if you see it. 
That was a flight there, folks. Parachute torn again, I see. It's coming down kind of like a streamer. I should have had an altimeter in there. It would have been nice to know what it did, speed and flight-wise. Yeah, that's, that, that was a launch. That thing went. And here we go. And touchdown. So that was an F44, very good motor on um, Aerotech. That was a composite motor, white lightning. It vanished off the pad and was way up there in a hurry. I see that plastic parachute got torn or singed or something. So I will check it out. Where Marlo at? Marlo's back there. Got some photos, hopefully. Yeah, that was a nice flight though. Nice flight. Last time I was out here, I lost my nose cone to the X30. It's out here somewhere, but I got a feeling I'll find it one day when I'm not looking for it. But let's check this out. So the SD's Executioner, real good flight on an F44 motor. Um, it disappeared off the pad. Yeah, this shoot is done. I really got to get, I gotta upgrade that to a, a nylon. But yeah, went great, went great. Overall, landed well. These are through the wall fins. Even with a parachute like that, it acted as a streamer. So, we're good to go. Nice flight. Still smoking. I don't know if you can see that smoke in there. Yeah, very good, good rocket. Three, two, one. Mars lander going in five, four, three, two, one. Parachute! Oh shoot! <laughs> that could be a broken leg or not. Hopefully not. It hit right on it, so let's see. Hit kind of hard on that leg. It looked like it's I don't know. Oh, parachute, come on. So here we have the Mars lander. Landed pretty hard, let's see what we got. So there's the parachute. Total disaster, not huge, it didn't open up as intended. But this leg right here, I can see inside, it's, um, it's fine to look at, but inside I know it, it broke apart. Cause these are like landers, if you know about the Mars lander. We will, um, or landing gears. So we will see what we can do to fix that. So as we take a look at my Model Rocks 321 t-shirt, you can get those too on the website if you're interested. You can get a Model Rocks 321 long sleeve, short sleeve, whatever. But anyway, today was a rough, day for the most part um i flew the sr-71 blackbird first as you, you saw the result of that the crash i'm probably going to scrap this project it may be the end of the sr-71 project x um next i flew my executioner on an f-44 it went really well no damage the rocket's good the engine um the parachute that plastic parachute just seemed to have gotten like tangled or ripped or something so a nylon shoot that was the best flight well the Mars lander went great, but I am super disappointed. One of the legs, the silicone piece up inside the leg is broken. So I'm going to have to either do a repair, I mean, opening this all up, fixing it. And I can do it. I can do it and get it all back as is. But man, what a rough day. Then this little piece here is actually loose. I, that's an easy, easy fix. But man, this is a not a great, great launch um, again. But... Model Rocks 321 is in this. I've been doing it for a long time. I love this. I'm going to continue to bring you more content. Like, share, subscribe to the channel. Um, and that's about it. I will be back with either more launches, a build, or something like that. I'm actually building two right now, and I'm working on my far side um, three-stager. So, And I see a little ding right there on the cone. So, yeah, I may end up making this a video showing you guys how to do a repair like that. I mean, it's going to have to take some over to get new decals, actually. I have to open it up and um, do the work. 
But luckily it didn't suffer too bad. And it's totally my fault. I did not um, open up, always repack your parachutes. I didn't do that and it tangled. So that's what happened. Anyway, Model Rocks 321. Like, share, subscribe to the channel. Appreciate you guys. Catch you later.